Hey guys, what's going on? So as you could judge by the title of the video, what we're doing today is putting an MHD tune on my 335i. Uh, I've used MHD several times before. I had another 335i and an N54 one, same year as this one, and an X3 M40i that we had both flashed with MHD. Always been happy with it. So that's what we're doing on this one as well. So we're going to dwell into how to install it, going through the whole process, and uh, just so I can show you guys how easy it is and how you guys can do it yourself. So let's jump into it. So the first thing MHD recommends, and I recommend as well, get yourself a battery charger, a battery tender, whatever you want to call it. Uh, buy it off Amazon. You can get it at Walmart, Target. Uh, you want to have this just in case. It, most cars, your battery is probably a little bit older. It's not a brand new car. The battery is not as powerful. I have flashed cars before that were newer or brand new, and the battery was just fine flashing it for 20, 30 minutes, but it's not a risk you want to take, especially, you know, essentially breaking a DME, possibly at the worst. You don't want to do that. So get yourself a battery charger, hook it up throughout this whole process, leave it running, so that way the battery doesn't die and you have bigger issues down the road. So now let's get into the car. All right, so now we're gonna jump in the car. And the first thing we're gonna do is plug in our wireless OBD adapter. Uh, this is a Thor one. MHD actually makes a wireless one now as well. Uh, I use this one with uh, Beamer Geeks Pro Tool with MHD. It works really, really well uh, over Wi-Fi. You can use a cable too. Uh, I've had no issues using cables. That's what I used to use in the past, but just having this makes things so much easier You don't have to worry about cables uh, So either way they all cost just about the same whether it's a cable wireless adapters a little bit more go for the wireless adapter Makes your life a lot easier. So we're gonna come over here. We're gonna plug it in to the OBD port You usually have a little cover over your OBD port. I took it off for the sake of the video and then you could see you also have your uh, little cover right here. And then we just plug the adapter in just like that. The next thing you got to do is hop in the car. Put the key in. Turn it to position number two. Turn all your accessories off. Turn your lights off. If your climate control's on, if your radio's on, turn all that stuff off. And now I'm going to hop on my phone and show you guys through the tuning process. So first things first, we want to make sure that we're connected to the adapter. Right there you can see the Thor Wi-Fi. We're connected. If you're plugging in via a cable, you're going to be automatically connected. You don't have to worry about the Wi-Fi. And uh, yeah, it's that simple. What we're going to do next is open up the MHD app. And you're going to come to this screen right here. You download the MHD app from the Play Store, and this is what it looks like when you download it. We're going to go to Flash, a MHD map, uh, version 9.0 maps beta is what I'm going to do. And I have already bought the maps previously. So when you click on it, if you haven't bought the maps yet, what's going to happen is you're going to click on, say, we're going to do the Stage 1 Plus tune here, 93 octane. And then you're going to select your transmission, which is an auto in my case. It's going to connect. You're not going to see this screen because you probably haven't bought the maps yet. You need to buy the licensing pack and the maps at a minimum. So it's going to bring you up to that. You're going to go into a separate screen and you just hit buy on the maps, buy on the uh, licensing, and then you can buy uh, data logging and a couple other things. So once you go back from that and you buy all those, you're just going to come back and it's going to bring you to this screen. So now what I'm going to do is go to options. There's tons of different options. You have your exhaust burble here. Uh, I'm going to put it to, let's just say medium for now. We don't want to get too aggressive with the burble like some people like to do. Uh, and let's set the duration for, I don't know, one and a half seconds in sport. And then we can see how we like that. And later on, we can change that if we don't like that. Uh, cold start noise reduction. That makes it so it doesn't rev up higher when it cold starts. If you don't want to make any noise in the morning. 
You have an option for the OEM CATA downpipes, which are currently on this car. I haven't installed the uh, VRSF downpipes that I have yet, so I'm going to select that. Uh, then over here, I'm going to set it to uh, performance for the coolant target. That way it opens up the thermostat a little bit sooner. And you can see tons and tons of other options. Uh, MHD has a very good uh, manual that you can download that shows you everything that all these options do. Or you can go online and see everything they do as well. And so I selected those options right there. And what I'm going to do next is go back. You can see there, everything's still selected. And go to airplane mode, which is important. You want to make sure that it's in airplane mode so nothing else happens. So it reconnects. And you can see it's starting the process. It's going to take several minutes. Uh, if you're plugged in with a cable, it could take up to 20 to 30 minutes. Uh, via Wi-Fi, it may be as soon as, you know, 5 to 10 minutes or 15 minutes. But it'll go through all of this and it'll show you exactly what it's doing. So just let everything sit. Don't bother it. And when it's done, it'll let you know it's done. You turn the ignition off. You turn it back on and it'll be good to go so you can see here it started the process it says there's about 29 minutes left that's an estimate so i'm just going to let it do its thing don't bother it don't mess with the car and then uh yeah we're going to come back once this is at 100 percent and uh show you guys what's going on after that all right guys so this is the final screen that you're going to get it says success, everything's all good. Turn the ignition off, you wait 30 seconds, and then you can start the car. So let's do that and uh, make sure everything's working fine. So I turned the ignition off, waited the 30 seconds, and now we're gonna start it up and make sure that everything is working fine. So yeah, there you go. Your car is now tuned. It's uh, pretty crazy that we can do all this stuff from our phone, uh, whether tune the transmission or the motor. And uh, it's that easy. Don't be afraid to do it yourself. And uh, yeah, if you guys like the video, uh, feel free to subscribe for more. I'm going to be filming how to do uh, XHP tune on the transmission next. And uh, I'm going to do more update videos with the MHD Tune as we install more parts on the car and as we go stage 2 and full bolt-on and some E85 there later on. If you guys have any questions, feel free to ask down below. I'll answer them. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.